Hey, quick update. What's going on? President's Day. I don't even know why. What are we doing? What are we celebrating here in America for that? Is that we uh, honoring all the presidents, past, current, future? Not sure, but it's a day off for my kids, uh, which is nice. I sort of have a day off. I've got a few uh, calls and bits and pieces to take care of. But the important thing is, I thought I'd give a quick update and let you know that uh, finally got uh, the Dark Valley uh, Case Blue scenario set up. And thanks to all the people who chipped in and helped with advice on uh, the um, Russian Soviet uh, defense. And now I've just got to come up with a plan for the Germans. In the meantime, because I'm kind of like that, I did get the uh, half of the 19th of October turn finished, so the Soviet side is done, and things are looking okay. I think the weather is going to help <laughs> my defense. <clears throat> really sad, but anyway. Uh, and I, uh, I've got Hannibal Rome versus uh, Carthage set up. But a friend has just offered to play that uh, on Vassal with me. And what I was thinking is I can play the game through with him, keep a log, and take the, the battles that come up, and then use the results from that to generate my uh, uh, my battles uh, and fight them discreetly that way. And then we'll see if they turn out the same or something. I'll work something out there. But I think that might be... Uh, Faster and more interesting for me than uh, than having basically I would have to have two games set up to to try and uh, handle that. The main reason why I'm thinking about that is because uh, I finished reading the rules for Breaking the Chains and I'd seen it played and sat and watched a little bit uh, when Jeff Newell and Mark Walker were playing at uh, the Game On conference in Seattle and I really liked what I saw. I like what I read in the rules. It seems pretty straightforward. The combat systems. Really, you know, it's really just uh, you're rolling a D10 or a D6 and uh, applying, uh, you know, modifiers, and that's it uh, against a, a base number for whether it's anti ship, air to ground, whatever the case may be. Uh, a few little tricky bits here and there. We're going to play the small scenario first. I think it's only three turns. See how that goes. And then uh, I got to find, I'm going to try and put that up here, I'm trying to set that up here next to the Dark Valley, and we'll see if that. Uh, that works out and plays well. And what else have I got going on? Uh, tomorrow night I'll be playing uh, the... Oh, I'm sorry. The Pan Panzers in the Ardennes. Uh, I'll be uh, playing that. So if you want to jump online and chat on Skype, we'll be on Skype. Uh, Steve Arthur and I will be playing. We'll hang out, just catch up, shoot the breeze. That'd be cool. And that's about it. That's all I got. So I just thought I'd touch, thought I'd touch base. I'm going to try and get the first turn of the Dark Valley done today on President's Day and then sneak in later tonight downstairs and we're going to do the Germans for the 19th of October and then uh, see where we're at with that game. Cool. Later. Button, button. Here it is.